On October 17, the Ukrainian missile forces used American Adams tactical ballistic missiles for the first time. Five rockets equipped with a cluster warhead were launched at the same time and led to an attack on the bases of the Russian aviation at the Berdyansk airfield, destroying a dozen helicopters of various modifications, military personnel, as well as warehouses with ammunition. In the released photos, you can see the production numbers of the rocket engines that were found near the airfield. With the signatures and examination of the markings, it became clear that these missiles belonged to the MGM-140A model. One of them was made in October, 1996. Development of Adams began in 1982, when the Pentagon combined missile development for ground forces and air defense forces into the JTACMS project. But in 1985, after awarding development contracts to several companies, the U.S. Air Force declared the air-launched ballistic missile project a failure and withdrew from the project, which was later renamed Adams Army Tactical Ground-Based Missile Complex. In May 1986, an Adams design contract was signed with the developer of MGM-52 Lance ballistic missiles. The first test launch of an experimental missile under the code XMGM-140A took place on April 26, 1988, and in December of the same year, production of a limited number of missiles began. The first serial missile under the index MGM-140A Adams entered service with the U.S. Army in January 1991. Adams is a ballistic missile with a solid propellant engine. M-142 HIMARS and M-270 MLRS launchers are used for launch. The MGM-140A belongs to the first generation of missiles of this line with a maximum flight range of 165 kilometers. It is equipped with an autonomous inertial guidance system with laser gyroscopes, but does not yet have a GPS satellite signal correction system. The missile guidance system provides a maximum circular deflection within a radius of 250 meters. Control of the missile in the air is carried out with the help of aerodynamic rudders located in the rear of the missile, which respond to commands from the onboard control system. This system continuously determines the expected drop point and corrects the trajectory. Although the missile is not characterized by high accuracy, its powerful cluster warhead weighing 560 kilograms compensates for this limitation. It contains 950 fragmentation submunitions of the M74 type. The M74 submunitions, which are filled with the M39 warhead, have a spherical shape and are designed for the task of hitting open targets by means of explosion and fragments. M-74 has a diameter of 75 mm and a weight of approximately 500 grams. During detonation, this ammunition emits about 260 fragments, creating a zone of damage with an area of up to 15 square meters. Its hemispheres are made of tungsten and alloyed with nickel and iron. They have fragmentation grooves that house the M-219A2 impact-type detonator and explosives. The hemispheres are externally wrapped with a steel shell and point connected to each other. Aerodynamic ridges on the outer casing impart spin to the submunition as it falls to activate the detonator. The same submunitions were spotted at the airfield site near Berdyansk, where Russian helicopters and military personnel were struck on October 17. Adams in service with the armed forces of Ukraine, what is known about the rocket, developed back in the 80s. Усім дякую за перегляд. Коментуйте новини, ставте лайки, підписуйтесь на канал. Підтримуйте канал фінансово. Деталі в описі до відео. Все буде Україна.